welcome to my channel for more news quickly subscribe and hit the notification bell for more updates. Princess Anne is said to have a weak spot with her nephew Prince Harry, which could be the key to healing ties within the royal family. The couple had an incredibly warm conversation at King Charles's coronation as they chatted and laughed before the ceremony at Westminster Abbey. In a commentary for the Mail, Kate Mancy said the pair have more in common than anyone can imagine, which means Anne will build a bridge between father and son. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex's relationship with the royal family, especially King Charles and Prince William, has been strained since the couple stepped down as senior members of the royal family in March 2020. The coronation is the first time Harry has been seen with his father and brother since candid memories of Spare and the Netflix documentary series. The prince was only seen talking to several members of the royal family, one of which was his aunt, this was caught on camera when Princess Anne stopped to talk to Harry, who was sitting in the third row of the monastery. The pair appear to have discussed Princess Anne's outfit with Libridas, suggesting that Harry told her, I don't mind. Sit in front, most likely in response to a question. About his seat. Princess Anne is often referred to as the hardest working royal, due to the number of engagements and performances she undertakes. The 72-year-old accepted a total of 214 engagements last year, more than any other member of the royal family. In the article, Ms. Mansi, deputy editor-in-chief of the Mail on Sunday, said Anne's knowledge of getting the job done was one of her most prized qualities. She said, it's the keep calm and carry on mantra that was taken from her parents. It also means he doesn't waste energy on injuries. A worldview that some believe Harry can perfectly emulate. Many people may not realize that Anne had a crush on Prince Harry from the start, especially when he lost his mother at such a young age. Ms. Mansi added, can the king and the country call on Anna to build a bridge between father and son question mark quotas with most things, a servant at least for a royal princess if duty is required, she will obey. An insider said the pair had a vile sense of humor and that Anna felt obligated to support her grandson following Princess Diana's death. They said, the Duchess has always had a soft spot for Harry and both have a great sense of humor. People say Prince Andrew is the backup, but Anne is also the second child, and especially after Diana's death, she has always felt an obligation to support her grandson. Both Anne and Harry have a great sense of humor and have more in common than you might think. In May 2008, 23-year-old Harry, known as Lieutenant Wales, was among 160 home Calvary members who received an application from Harry is the first member of the royal family to do active duty since his uncle Prince Andrew piloted a helicopter during the Falklands War.